Okay, so you are <laughs> uh, you are dating your significant other, of course. Your signi- there you are. Yeah. You are with your significant other. Uh, you guys have been in a relationship for quite a while. Yeah. And it's very comfortable. You're doing great. Okay. Um, before, previous to this relationship, you have a best friend that is the opposite sex. So you have a female best friend. Uh-huh. Um, there is a traumatic and... Um, uh, I do remember this question. You do remember now? Yeah. There's a traumatic uh, event. event that uh very sad. Let's say let's say the death of a family member. Okay. Right? A parent. Mm-hmm. A parent. Like a parent. The death of their parent, mm-hmm. right? Okay. Their one living parent or, you know, both their parents. Whatever is like traumatic. Like it's devastating. Gotcha. Uh, they reach out to you because they're you're, you're their best friend. Mm-hmm. And they say, you guys don't live in the same state anymore. So they live at least two or three states away. Yeah. They're like, I need you to come. And stay with me and help me through this process right now. Like I need you for like three, four days. Yeah, man, pull up. Yeah, that's not a, that's not gonna happen for my significant other. That's not happening. Why not? Because and he's and it's a guy. Yeah. So since he's your significant other, it's a dude right. that's calling her. Like right. let's say it just happened. So it's like he's calling at two o'clock in the morning. Right. Hey, your significant other. Right. Uh, I need you down here. My dad just died. You know, I'm like that's that was my last family member. You know how close you guys were as well. Right. Like I really need your support, right? And to help me guide me through this next, or or, or just no, be with I just, me. I just need some I to need, help I me need, through need this next love. situation. I need to be surrounded by some love. The, the my best friend, the person that my right. last family, like, basically. I need, I need some consoling. I understand. Uh, so yeah. you're not okay with this? Uh, my my significant other, my girl, cannot go down there for a few days. She can go down there for the funeral. But, and, but they're best friends. Girl. Yeah, the, I mean they were best friends. They no 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 they were best friends until why are you saying that why are you saying it like once that once I came into the picture mm-hmm, 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 she mm-hmm. that is no longer her her best friend because I am now her best friend okay I see Wanda. what you're saying because so, you would be her best friend since you're in a relationship right. that's the whole point of the relationship right. mm-hmm, okay mm-hmm. um so so with that being said if I have no problem with her going down there to to get to show her love to the family and to her friend mm-hmm. but she's not going down there for days on end neither. Is she going to like drop what she, whatever she's doing that moment at, as soon as he calls or anything like mm-hmm, that? Mm-hmm. So um, that's that's my personal answer. You need me, okay? I mean, you need her. So how do you feel about that situation? And then I'm gonna get into I'm gonna expound a little bit more because there's some okay. stuff I still want to ask you. Okay. Um, I that whole few how many days? Three days? You said, she said yeah, three, a couple four days. days. You said, right? yeah, three yeah, days was a I don't know, a couple days. She said three to four days. Three to four days. You out there? She's out there and a all couple states away. I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of with Crump a little bit with the not going over there for that long. But there's two ways of this, right? So you said she, he, he could have been an ex. No, he's not an ex. He's not an ex. Okay, that's good because if it was an ex, there's no. They've fuck never had sex. All right, so if it's a best friend, then I put the trust on my shorty on that that she can handle that. So because she can go Phoenix, for three or four days. No, she can go for a day, and then I'm she can sure. just go for the funeral. Yeah, for the funeral. What if she says I want to go? For I want to go. Days. Right, so or I'll do you feel some kind of way about that? Same question to you. Wow, I'd like to know what I, you, well, I, what, how you go about it. I gotta Me? put the trust. Yeah. I gotta put the trust in. My, I gotta put the. I gotta put the trust in my shorty, and I gotta. I mean, I mean, I trust. If that's her best I, friend, if that's her best friend, I'm trust. I know I trust this guy. That she's not gonna do anything. It's not about me not thinking she's gonna do, me thinking she's gonna do something. Yeah. It's not that. So what is it about then? It's Why are you so you don't adamant need to that be there for three? Like, and she's not gonna want to. But be that's there not for, three for you. Days. But but, I, no, 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 but no, no, no. can you see a perspective that what you're saying right now is mad insensitive and you're being disrespectful? No, you don't know their relationship or what they have I mean, personal one on one. How are you? How can you say that there's no reason for her to be down there for three or four days? That's her best friend. He's in. I mean, exactly. just lost a parent. The best friend, like said, the like best said, friend is what not, keeps it. They're not best friends anymore. I hear that. So, so oh, what, you're, what, so what, you, what you're what saying? You so, what, what you're you, saying? What I'm gonna answer doing? whatever question you ask me. Well, well, well so what I, you're I saying like to, is, at least before you, like, like, before we dive even deeper into my okay. explanation, I like to at least know, like, uh, do you want to set me up or should I just um, answer the question? Just answer it, bro. Yeah, just answer it. Um, I would like to think that if that's her best friend, I would like to think that if that is her best friend, um. Then yeah, man, go be with your best friend. You, you know, just lost a parent or something. It's crazy. Like, I've... go support your best friend. Cause me personally, mm-hmm. and I'm not. I have no issue saying this. Like, if I'm in my emotional bag, I do need somebody with me. I mean, maybe I don't need them, but I would prefer yes. to have somebody that I, I trust, so. I, I feel so. comfortable with with me during those times. I would rather not do that alone. 
personally. Okay, so rather not do it alone. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Let's say you had a girl. Let's say you have um, a girl. You're in a new relationship. Let's say you're with her for a year. That's is pretty that, substantial that, amount okay, of time. All right, well, then what's whatever. All right. Well, then maybe let me take a the year. Time. I feel let like a lot can be. Let me take the time away. Let me take the time away. Let me take the amount of time away. You have a girl, and you go you go through the same thing. You lose a uh, you God forbid, like you lose a family. You lose a parent. I lose a you lose family. a parent, yeah. and you're able to have yeah, and you're okay. able to have one person in the room with you in like the hospital room, and would you choose? Let's say. You have a female best friend, mm-hmm. and you have a girlfriend. I do have a female best friend. Uh, you do have a female best friend, and you have a girl. With, you're, only, you're only able to bring one person in there. Who are you choosing to bring in? I think, me personally, the way my life is set up, because you're asking me directly, right? Yeah. There's not like a general thing. You're asking me if, yeah. if this happened to me. Yeah, well, I would yes. want my girl with me. Uh-huh. Even if it's like Even though I have more time. Let's say it's a, new, let's say it's a newer relationship. That's tricky. I feel like I would still want my girl there more because even if we don't have the time, and this is these are the times we're putting. This is the stuff so, so that builds the times. So then, so these are the these are the moments so these are, that are important. Right, so these like, are the moments that we she's build. Gotta, the, yeah, the, the, so, so I want to bring her in. My friend has moments like right. So with that, if, if that's being if that being said, mm-hmm. then as soon as you get a girl, like I don't like. I don't think you're your wife and girls left and right. Like like easy like you're not just like you're not falling in love every single second. So I know that. So it takes it takes a minute for you to 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 say like, yo, that's my girl. Yeah. yeah. So with that being said, mm-hmm. then as soon as you get a girl, then your female best friend isn't your best friend anymore. That's what you're saying. Because if you if you're always gonna choose your girl to come with you into in that in that doctor's room to hear the outcome. That yeah. female best friend loses that title as soon as you get a girl. I like the way you're wording that. So I'm going to push back and try to reword the question if that's okay with you. Yeah. To just lock it into no, a we're scenario. Lo- we're volleying the question back and forth. Yeah, we're just trying to lock it in. Yeah. You know, Bleak, at any no, no. time, you let me know. If no, 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 man. Feel you're dis- you know, disagreeing no. with. Yeah. Um, so just lock it in. Yeah. Now that you have a girl, mm-hmm. we're gonna consider and go in with the point that your girl is now your best friend. I'll concede that to you. She's not, or she. Your girl is now your best friend. Okay. So I'll give you that because the way you're wording that, I, I would agree that your girl should be your best friend, right? Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, if it's just a girl I'm dating, then yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm probably not gonna call her because I'm, but, we're just dating. Yeah. Your relationship is serious enough. She's your best friend now. Right. But however. She's never met you, your father. <coughs> your girl. <coughs> like, he's been sick the whole time that you got with this new girl. Right, and we live... So there. she's never really had that... Like, cause we, I might, let's say we don't live in the same state or something like that, and I might just... Or say, even if you live in the same state, when you started dating her, he's been sick this whole time. So okay. she's never really met him as himself. Okay. okay. She just met him sick. Okay. Like, he's not responding. You know what I mean? There's no real back and forth with them. And your friend has been your friend for 15, 20 years. Is it? And, the, and you, her and your father were really close. Is my father conscious right now? He's not. He's dead. Okay. The, the, that, the fact that they haven't met doesn't really mean anything. It's, it's about me and her's current connection. But and you can understand how some, some people would choose no. the best friend no. who has the, I don't, the shared I don't, experiences with the father. Course. It would be more memorable to them. I mean, not, if this is the initial right after the news comes, then yeah, yeah no, it doesn't matter. I want my girl there. Yeah. Even if she's never met him, that's mm-hmm. irrelevant. Yeah. I'm in pain because I, I suffered a loss. Mm-hmm. I want my significant other to, to console me. First and foremost, and okay. then my and then my best friend, she's next up. Yeah. Like if, if if that's what it, if if the, my next best friend after my girl uh, like is there, then yeah, she's next. He or she's next up as yeah. the second person. But even if it was a dude, like even if it was my man who I've been who who I knew even a lot, like I mean, guy like male best friend or female friend, yeah. best friend, that doesn't matter. So doesn't even matter. Like I always want my significant other there. More so than a yeah. friend, because we have a deeper connection together. So you would be upset if, if she was like, "Yeah, I go. I want to go to this. This is my best. Fr- like he's she, my. You're she, my. You're my best friend now. But he is like we have this history, this shared history, and he needs me right now. I want to go. Would you be upset if she said she was wanted? Like go, I'm going. If she, 
I said she can go to the funeral. No, 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 not even no, 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 it's she, not even about said you can go. I'm just asking. I'm changing. I'm giving you another scenario based on the scenario. She said she wants with. to go for three. She's four like, days. I want to go for three, four days. I'm not gonna go for four days. I will go for two and a half days. I mean, I don't want you to fly. I'm in. I'm trying to com- no, no, compromise. I'm saying, with no, no, you. no, I'm saying I'm not, I don't want you to fly in and then go to the funeral and then fly out that t- and do everything in one day. I'm not yeah. saying that. But but yeah, I'm going to help. There's set no more up. than two days. Like let's say yeah. let's say you leave on Friday. Uh-huh. You leave early on Friday. Let's say the funeral's Friday, and then or Saturday, yeah. and you you fly in early. You spend Friday with him and his the rest of his family. Oh, right. yeah. You go to the funeral uh, the next day, and then you leave that night. You you hang out at the rese- the repast after that or whatever, and then you leave after that. There's I'm no- thinking more of like the funerals on Saturday. Uh-huh. She flies in Thursday, spends Thursday. Help set it up, like get go talk to the people. I mean, does it, Friday? Does this person have no help, other family member? You, that you, I'm asking. Basic, you. no. This is now. She's like his last family member now. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I, I, in, in this day and age of social media and the internet, I feel that you can do all that stuff remotely anywhere that you are, and she can, she can, she can honestly say, "Yo, I'll be if, if the funeral Saturday and this is Thursday. Mm-hmm. Yo, I'm gonna do as much as I can on my end to set up, make sure the body, da 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 da, da have the flowers, set up food arrangements because there's the internet, and I can yeah. go on the internet and set all this stuff up. So when I come through, it's all it's all it's already been set up. So mm-hmm. I we can just you know mourn together so, and so and I'm saying like so your answer would be that you would be upset with her saying yes I want to go spend the three days or four days I'm saying she's saying yes I'm going that's it what can you do after that you just got to deal with it got to deal with it or yeah. you are is this, gotta support her. Uh, is yeah, this, no, a, is like, this a breaking I, point here is, is this is this a breaking point that you want to no. like no 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 it's not a breaking point because no, it reminds me of another her. question an age old question okay. and it, like it's the same kind of vein like mm-hmm. your your girl, your significant other gets a call, and the call is like your ex boyfriend just died, and she is devastated. Your what? Your ex boyfriend just died. Yeah, and she's devastated. She's devastated. Like I mean, she's would, like she is. I give her. I give her the five crying. minutes. I give her her five. No, no, minutes. no, no. She is balling. Devast balling on the floor. Hi, right, I'll give her the I day. Mean, no, I don't. I'll give her the day. Everyone deserves that. I mean. It shouldn't be. Ha- it shouldn't like, unless unless y'all were like married or and like they dated for they dated for five years. Like that. They dated for five years. Then yeah, nah, she shouldn't be on the floor bawling her face out. Nah, when she died. Man. nobody likes people to die. So yeah, I mean, especially if you love die. somebody and they yeah, die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you, lo- you she eventually you, knew you, this. You person. love them at a point, but I feel that when that relationship's over, the, it's a, you have a different type of love that you always want them to to to. You ultimately want them to be happy and stuff like that, but. If they die, it's sad. I'm not saying you're not going to be sad, but, like, sobbing for days on end. Is that what you're saying? They're sobbing for, like... I'm saying, like, a, the, the day, one day, yeah. they're, like, completely, like, they're done. There's nothing they can do for you. They're mm-hmm. done to the world. Yeah, wow. nah, I don't, I don't... Like, she's locked in the room know. crying. Everything's making her cry. Yeah, nah, I don't... Yo, I don't, you guys, be careful. Be careful with Crump, yo. He's, it's too easy for him to detach emotions from everything. Like y'all, be, y'all gotta be careful around this kid. Yeah. Giving me Dexter vibes. I mean, no, it's it's if, unless if you're doing that, then I don't think you were over the person. Mm. Then we have something to talk about. Or maybe they just love big. Nah, man, I mean, they just what? really knew maybe this they person. just love big. They that knew was this their, person. Yeah. What I if mean, they? What if they? I've, you have to. You have to be crying. You have to be bowling over over the littlest things for me to believe that's what you're doing. Nah, when people man. die. Maybe they. Just, some people get very emotional when people die. I mean, you might just be one of not be one of those people. I do get emotional okay. when people die. I lost a love with I lost my dad when I was fourteen. So maybe that makes it a little different when it comes to people dying. Maybe. So you don't think I mean, you would cry if you lost an ex? I no. No exes would make you cry. No exes would make me ball out. Friends and be out of commission. Friends for a day. die. Yeah. Out but of commission I'm, for a day. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna. I'm definitely gonna want to be to myself. Okay. You're not gonna want to be with somebody else. Other I mean, friends that have a mutual what, friendship. What, what, I like, however I'm feeling at the moment is how I'm feeling at the moment. But I'm gonna feel sad that one of my friends much, because huh? that relationship is, is that relationship is still an intact relationship. Uh-huh. Um, an ex is not a still ongoing relationship. So that I sh- I severed that relationship at a point, and mm-hmm. and time has healed that wound if there was a wound. Okay. And yes, I feel bad that the person died because I'm I feel bad that any I hear anybody dies earlier than they should have died. But you ain't balling. But I'm not balling. Because that's because 
that would be that would mean that there's something still there mm. for that person, in I my opinion. It. I understand that. Bleak, anything extra? Um, put any sauce no, to put no, on yeah, that? I mean, yeah. Like, like I said, I'll give it a day. She, she deserves a day. Everyone does. Uh, so I won't be mad if she's crying about it. I understand. I mean, yeah. She knew this someone person. Someone died. Yeah, someone died. I don't, you know, if I that's to... my girl, I would know what she... What this person meant to her. Usually, people speak about that yeah. in relationships. Yeah, you would, you would, you would kind of be have a heads up, like, okay, this person. Oh, yeah, geez. it's kind of like the whole thing with the best friend as well. Like, if that's her best friend and her best friend is the one calling her to come down, like, you obviously know this person because if you've been in a relationship with her for a certain amount of time, I think you will know her best friend. So, mm-hmm. so, um, yeah, you do know her ex. So you know her ex, and uh, that was the one right before you. And, mm-hmm. you know, they had a weird breakup like this. Maybe this he did her dirty, but, you know, she still had mad love for him, but she had to yeah, he might have done her through that or whatever. Yeah, he might have done certain things. Yeah, he like, just did, he just, you know, maybe he had a problem, like an issue, like a drug mm-hmm. issue or something like that. You feel me? Doesn't so, necessarily make him a bad person. Yeah, you know well, what that, I mean? That, like, so opinion, she had feel, to get away from it. I feel, yeah. in, I feel in, that, in my opinion, that There's changes kind of it. Scenarios. That changes the whole thing, in my opinion. How does it? What, what because it goes from just being about loving them and missing them, if they're just boohooing that they died, to you help them get over something traumatic, and yeah, that's, that's why. But I'm not even saying it. Like, connection. see, I'm just trying. To, I'm trying to give you another kind of aspect of it because you completely. There, right? No, I'm saying. I'm saying that changes com- it. I'm no, saying that changes it. It doesn't change it because the question was the question was their ex dies and they're crying and they're distraught yeah. over it. Yeah. Are you? How do you feel about that? And you are saying that's out of control. I mean, you didn't say. So, you didn't, I don't have you to give you I'm that saying, part. You know, I, I'm basing it off of what's at least given to me, and I yeah, think and what, given, if it if it's nothing other than they just broke up, yeah. then yeah, if you're crying over the person boohooing, but there's always going to be context to, to everything. You passed it to me. I did. Yeah. There's oh, always going to be context high, to bro. everything. We baked again. Damn. Back to back. I, I just passed it. So make nah, you sure. Me. Yeah, oh. Nah. Right. God damn. We got to cut that out. All right, so back to what we were talking about. Yeah, no, I, I, I think that changes it for me. That changes it. Like if it's something super specific that they went through or something that that could change it. it depends on what it is. This is what I be talking about, though, Crump. Like this is what I be talking about. Like the question is set up in general. You have to put your yeah, your it, it, your every... minds your mindset is. So like all right, so once again, the question was. If your ex, ex she, your your girlfriend, your significant other uh-huh. gets a phone call that her ex, ex dies, dies and she's distraught over it, yeah, exactly. Of course, there's context to it. It can't just be like your ex dies, like Damn. oh, some nigga and I'm crying. Yeah, man, like, you, they were the ex, so there's yeah. gonna be something. I mean, to are you crying? You know, over every, are you are you are you, is what, it, are you crying? Like, so basically, the question is 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 is, 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 is said significant other crying over every single ex that she that has died, or is this a sp- special ex? This just what this is the only time it's happened. I'm I'm a, I'm asking you. You've never she's saying, never she never had another I'm, ex I'm die in, in this scenario that you're creating. Yes. If if there was multiple exes that died, is she crying over all exes, or is it nah, this, this ex one in particular? Time. No, this one time. I'll answer this question. I don't understand the relevance at it's all. It's just one time, right no now. No relevance. It, it helps at me all. answer the question. She's crying over. All recent exes that were like a long period of time. Significant like, like, exes. Like if any ex dies while y'all are together, is she crying over? Not that? any ex. The ones that she dated for five plus years. Oh well, then yeah, that makes see. There's differences. There's, that. Yeah, but why wouldn't you automatically think that if the question is her ex dies and she's crying, wouldn't it be because they have a, a close relationship? Wouldn't that automatically be entered into your head? I, like no, you take no. emotion out of everything. <laughs> like when you answer yeah. the question, it's your answers. But I feel like you just completely take emotion away from it. Like, oh, why would she ever have feelings for somebody else? That doesn't make sense. There, because she's a human being. Yeah. I mean, you have feelings for multiple people. You can still love somebody but not be in love with them. No, you, you can have having a, love for somebody and yes. being in love are two are showing two different types of emotions. That's what I'm saying. So you can still I mean, love. So th- those are still, two different types of actions. And you can cry for somebody you love. Nah, yeah, you can care for someone. You man. You can cry over somebody. You can cry over yeah. a thing that you I, love. You can you care for still things. love the person and not necessarily. What's the difference yeah. between being in love and, not, and just loving somebody? What's the difference? To be in like, love, like to, and just to have love for somebody and want. Good for I'm, somebody. You keep saying have love. Just, just under this, par- just for me. Like, please. It, like for under me, this parameter. So for, for, for me, being for me. in love and loving someone. You yeah. can love somebody and you, be I, in love with you them. You can do both. No, yeah, there's I, two different I, things. I, I, then, At then, the same there's time. three. Then y'all are forgetting the, the the other one where you're just having love for people because I feel like I having love is just I, the, a way of saying I'm polite exes, to somebody. Like any of my exes, like I, I can, have love for them and I want to see them do great, but I'm not still in love with them. Okay. Or I still don't love them. Why do you keep saying I still don't love them. The, you, I don't love them. I feel like you have a... Pro- active, to me, that's active. That's fine. Yeah. That's a verb. It's, it's, it's something... I'm not actively doing that. Exactly. So that's why I'm saying I have love for them and I want to see them do good. But, but having love for them. somebody would be loving them. No. 
How could it not be? Because I'm if, if they call me to do something, I'm not gonna do. So what's the difference between having them. love for somebody and loving I don't somebody? What's see the them? difference between those two things? One is just from from afar. I just want to make sure. I, not make sure. I just hope nothing bad happens to you. Yeah. And then one is if you call me, I'm actively. If you call me for some help, I'm actively doing it. Is that more like caring I'm not for someone? Gonna, if you call me for something, you might care for because someone, of like right. If you call me to do something, I'm not. I'm not necessarily gonna do that. For 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 some, if not all, my exes. I mean, especially in the positions and 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 areas and pl- areas of life that they so might be. So you say in. so you would you would you would break down your affection for people in three categories. Okay. I mean, we're talking about in exes, love, not love, people. Ex, ex, I mean, exes. there's 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 different quality for I mean, exes. You would break it down in three categories: yeah. being in love with them, uh-huh. loving them, and having love for them. Okay. Yeah, I think I think yeah, I I guess I guess, I guess uh, like I guess I just know that if they're an ex, I have yes. love for you. You have love for them, but you don't love them. No. Oh man. So if they died, not, you wouldn't be upset. You wouldn't feel any kind of way. I I'd feel bad because would I, you the cry? Person, Do you think you could cry for? An ex? I don't think I'd cry. Okay. Hmm. Do you think you could have a connection with somebody that would be an ex that you could cry for? Yeah. Uh, not currently. Is it a possibility? You think? I mean, I haven't experienced it. I haven't. I haven't had an ex that if they personally, like. But could you see it as a possibility? No. Nah. Okay. Okay. Anything bleak? <laughs> emotionless. Like, I'm not emotionless. Yes, you are, my nigga. To me, it's like three different. That's levels. emotionless. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nah, it's like three different levels. You can how can you right, love how can you someone? cut off emotions like that? I'm not. It's, I said I. You could break up with somebody. I explained. I explained still, in the answer earlier. I said with time heals wounds if there are wounds. Like yes, in time, he did say that. I'm not. But he did say like, that though. Yeah. What? No, no, it's okay. Yeah, talking, but what, I'm saying like. Don't worry about it. What if it's not about wounds? Sometimes yeah. you can have a mutual breakup and y'all still love each other. I want the best for you. Mm-hmm. I care about you. If there's anything I can do for you, I will yeah. do it for you. To a certain, you know, boundary because we are not together. Nah, some people don't experience that. I haven't experienced that. Yeah. Okay. But do you see that as a possibility in life, or do you think that's ludicrous? Do you think that that's absurd? I mean, to I, think that I, that's, I, I feel that situation I feel, I feel could those, exist. Is feel, that absurd? I feel if that's the the type of relationship you have, that the door is not necessarily closed on your relationship on possibly getting together. So you, so if you love somebody, that means the doors are no, open. No, I think the the way you set it up, or or, or the scenario that you presented. I don't think I think those I think there's a chance that those two people could ultimately get back together, and I'm talking in situations where you're never going to get back together with the person. I'm I I got love for you, and I want to make sure that I, I hope all the best for you, but we don't have any active co- communication, no active communication, yeah. because we 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 closed the the door on that type of on that relationship. Mm-hmm. So if I saw you in trouble or in pain, yeah, I'd help you because I want to see you do good and I lo- and I love and that's the sense of I love you. If, if you're in if you're in pain and shit yeah. like that, yeah, I'll come through real quick. But I'm not we don't have an active commun- we don't have active uh lines of communication. I feel like you don't even have to have active lines of communication to love people. Like you love your great aunt, you don't ever I, fucking call her. I mean, I do. I'm not, I'm not I'm not saying you specifically. No, I'm just like, saying. You know what I'm but, saying? Like, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. but there's like cousins the, you don't talk to in like a long true. time. You it's love true. the shit out of them. Yes, it's true. So it's, it's not true. about contact. I feel like yeah, but you're, that, you feel but, like but, it's but, inappropriate. But that's something that that's something that's different because mm-hmm. we're tied together from blood. We we chose to join in a relationship together and we chose to end the relationship. So it's not like family's an ongoing thing. Like there's no friendship is an ongoing thing. I mean, we we were in a romantic relationship. And if we want to choose to be friends after that, then cool. We're friends, and we love each other as friends. Yeah. But that same... But uh, I'm saying love but doesn't so don't, have so don't, to be... So don't throw it in the same category as the love as in your relationship. But I'm not. I'm just not. saying the word love. You're automatically well, well, attributing I'm to, to I'm, it romantically. I'm sorry. I'm trying yeah. to be a little more specific. And, and, no, but... but and, and, and now and, and we're as clear. I'm trying to and be now as clear. Now we're down. So you don't think that I'm... Say, I'm that Because the way I'm taking it and the mm-hmm. way I'm interpreting it is that... There's a possibility that romantically we, those two people can go can get back together. Maybe that's just how you're seeing the word love. Once you hear the word love, that's how you're seeing it. Okay. I mean, if we're talking about so people who were in a relationship, so, you feel me? Like, yeah, yeah, that's cool. Wow, wow, that was uh, that was crazy. That was a kind of deep conversation right there. I didn't expect that. <laughs>